morning everyone, it's Anya here from Cooking with Plants and I'm going to actually start today doing um, what I eat for the next 30 days, breakfast, lunch, dinners, any snacks that I may have. Um, basically, I decided to do this because I lost 24 kilos after going vegan, which is about 50 pounds. And I find that a lot of our friends and family and, and people I run into that haven't seen me for a while keep asking me, well, what do you eat? What do you eat? Do you eat lettuce leaves or grass or whatever? And no, I don't, funny enough. So I thought, okay, next 30 days, every day I'm just going to do a quick recording of what I eat. So basically in the mornings, I'll start with about a litre of water before I have anything. And quite often I'll have a um, fruit smoothie or um, just a fruit salad or something like that for breakfast. So this morning I'm going to have some bananas because we've got a box of bananas here that are very ripe and need to be used up. And I'll make that smoothie right now. So when you get your bananas, you want to make sure they have brown spots on them, which means they're ripe. If they're still green or just plain yellow, then they're not ripe at all. So you just going to have to wait a few days, put them in a warm spot or out in the sun and they'll ripen up really quickly. Oops, oh, the banana peels on the floor. Okay. water, just plain water and blend it up, or um, I actually sometimes have coconut water on hand, you might even buy a fresh coconut at the shops and just open it up and get the water out of it, but I'm going to use canned coconut water, so it is 520 mils, about two cups of coconut water there, and four bananas. Okay, so I've just had my breakfast smoothie, whereas um, my husband's having a different creation. This is what he prefers to have for breakfast. He just has a mixture of fruits, sometimes a few walnuts and some oats. So I know there's a kiwi fruit hiding down oh, the bottom there. Kiwi fruit as well. Okay, so this is the final brekkie that my husband's about to have. So what have you got there? I've got about 10 dates, some fresh walnuts, some oats, a whole mango, a whole banana, a couple of kiwi fruits, and I think that's about it. Normally I'd like to throw in a few blueberries or strawberries, but we don't have any today, so I'm just going to live with what I've got, and I, I can't really fit in any more than that, so <laughs> I'll have to live with it. A good but start. Yummo. Okay. Let's, let's get it. started. careful because there's a big big deep hole. I love the, I love the dates so I have to sparingly measure those against everything else. Anyway. Good? Of course it's always good. <laughs> okay so now I'm about to have my lunch for the day and I had quite a lot of um, vegan junk food yesterday. I had lots of pizzas and things for lunch so I think it's caught up with me today and I just feel like quite a light lunch. So I'm having seven dates and I'm going to have this, it's quite a big mango, it's nearly as big as my hand, it's huge. So I'm going to have a mango, I've got a glass of grape juice and before I start all that I'm going to have about a litre of water as well, or in the US you would say a quart of water. So that is my lunch for now and if I decide to have a snack mid-afternoon, I will show you exactly what I'm going to eat. Okay, so it's now about 4.30 and I'm just having a um, soy chai latte, just as a little pre-dinner drink. 
So this is what I'm using here, the chai mix, and we've just frothed up some soy milk as well. See you for dinner. Okay, so it's now 7 p.m. and we're just having our dinner. And tonight we're having some steamed potatoes layered with some steamed broccoli. And then we've got a cheesy mushroom sauce made with um, some low sodium veggie stock mixed with corn flour, white pepper and nutritional yeast. So it's kind of like a potato, broccoli, mushroom casserole. Yum. Mm. What's your verdict? Um, I didn't listen to anything of what was in it, but all I know is it's yummy. <laughs> See you tomorrow.